Hello YouTube. Alright, originally I wasn't going to film myself shopping in here. I'm actually inside Walmart. But um, I was looking for some items and happened to be by this... Um, I'm looking for soy sauce, basically. But came by this aisle, which has like the um, Mexican food, you know, the um, Latin food stuff. And they had Badia here. They actually had the Badia and it's like $1.88. Uh, but it's a six ounce container, which is almost probably like twice the size, almost twice the size of the one at um, Dollar Tree, which is $1.25 now. So I went crazy and I bought like um, <laughs> two, four, five, five of these things. So that's like a little under $10 for my body of six. Yeah, it's, um, you know, it's $1.25 at um, the dollars, Dollar Tree. And 188 at this particular Walmart. So I went ahead and grabbed a whole bunch. I'm wondering if I should get another one. I don't have to make another run. Like I, I took almost all of them. I'll leave some for other people. But yeah, uh, looking for soy sauce. Some other stuff I got. I uh, sadly missed all the cheaper ribs, but I have some spare ribs here for 12.34, which is pretty cheap. Um, the other ones were like 18 to 24 dollars. Sometimes you see them as low as like the $10 ones. I try to grab like two, three, four of them. Uh, but I managed to grab one. And bought a bunch more chicken nuggets for work. These are like 12 something, almost $13 a bag. But they last me about two weeks. And then got some of this Garden Rotini, which is like um, 92 cents. Still a pretty good bargain. Pasta is still fairly cheap. The Rotini is cheaper than some of the other stuff. So I grabbed the Rotini and I got the... Um, great value brand which is cheaper um was gonna get some spaghetti but they don't have any of the 78 cent spaghetti so i'm gonna hold off on that but yeah just uh trying to stockpile bought a bunch of um ramen noodles i think they were like 224 or something like that for 12 pack which has gone up but um still affordable so I think that's pretty much it. I think what I need now is um, soy sauce, and after that I need um, some motor oil for my car and some bar chain oil for um, the chainsaw to, to work on the yard. But here's the soy sauce. I've been um, trying to find the giant containers, and they don't seem to have them. Here's the giant container. So I, I usually prefer to buy like these big ones. Yeah, there's some, I guess they had it buried behind all this stuff. I'm debating if I want to get two of them. One should last a while. Two of them gets more expensive, then, you know, I don't have to come back here for a while. And next time you come over, price is going to be like crazy high on them. I like Kick'em On. Um, you know, they have cheaper ones, but Kick'em On... It's the kind I like. You can see I buy a whole bunch of it because I use it for everything. I use it to make fried rice. I use it on the uh, the ribs. I even use it on my steaks. So, stockpiling. I, do, I have plenty of rice. I'm not going to buy any more rice. I think this is it for the food from Walmart. Um, I am going to go pick up some um, salad. I could buy it here, but it's cheaper to go across the street to Aldi's. So I'm going to go to Aldi's and buy some more um, produce because I think it's cheaper there and better. And um, that's going to be my day. I don't know how prices are in your area, but uh, the price at this Walmart has gone up quite a bit. Let's look at the, the regular body of here. See how they have the smaller containers? They probably have body of here too, and it'll cost more. It's like, look at these. These are like $2.60, $3.00. And they're like the small size. Trying to see a price comparison. So they can have like the same product, but in a different aisle. See how they're like two dollars here, and these are like small. Look at the container on these. This isn't body of it. This is like the Dollar Tree size. See the difference in sizes. But um, I don't know. I got these <laughs> freeze dried try shives. I don't know what chives are and what you use them for. But, um, oh yeah, I need these. I have a stockpile the same ingredients, you know. These are a dollar each, so I'm going to buy a whole bunch. 
I use um, Badia and the crushed, crushed minced, crushed or minced onions. How much do I have? I think I have about three, I'll get six. So these are each a dollar. I don't see the Badia here. But if it were here, it'd be like two dollars, which is more than that. Um, two dollars or more. So now they had the Badia. These are all Badia stuff, and they were like two dollars and sixty-eight cents. So it's like the same item, but by getting it, um, I have six of these. T four six, and I'm debating if I want red peppers. If that's the red pepper for only two eighty eight, I think I'm gonna grab this big huge thing of um, body of red peppers. I already have plenty, but I'll, I'll you know it doesn't hurt to get more. This is when I don't have any um, fresh peppers. I'll use the um, the red peppers. I think that's about it for um, seasoning. And the um, only thing that remains for me to do is to go get oil. So maybe I'll, I'll take you guys along with me. We can look at, we can check prices and see what they look like as of um, today, which is, uh, I think it's like August the 8th or so. I don't even pay attention to days anymore, but it's Monday, August something. I think August the 8th. And water is super expensive now at Walmart. I don't need any water, but I want to go show you what the prices currently are. You see, it's six fifty-two for um, Dasani. The kind I normally get is this: the Zephyr Hills. The Zephyr Hills twenty-four packs. Is it, no, thirty-five. That thirty-five packs. Thirty-five and a half a liter. They're six dollars and twenty-eight cents now. They used to be like 456 or something like that. They've gone up like almost two dollars. That, that's not eight <laughs> percent. It's not ten percent. These things here used to be a dollar fifty. These minute made things. Uh, they're dollar sixty-eight, so they've gone up. Not too much on that. But it, it's weird uh, how the price differences are. Certain items almost doubled and others have um, only gone up like Ten percent, fifteen percent. The eggs here are the small eggs. These are actually they're saying large eggs. Are three nineteen. I don't know if they have the small eggs, extra large. So they have large and extra large. They don't have the small ones. And jumbo. You get eighteen eggs for nine thirty-seven. Ah, uh, that's a little high. Is that eighteen? No, thirty-six. Thirty-six. And then of course they sell these. I guess restaurants would buy those or something. I can't see somebody buying 60 eggs unless they eat a lot of eggs. And brown eggs. Um, I usually get these. But see, what's crazy is I don't know if you guys remember me in this this same Walmart. I think it was this same Walmart. Uh, probably about two years ago, three years ago, two and a half, three years ago. The eggs were 78 cents. These exact same eggs were 78 cents, and now they're 3.19. So that's like 300, 400% increase. In the back, tip for you, by the, uh, usually at the back of the store, they will put, sometimes, uh, it's not in the back, sometimes it's by the, uh, the bread department, but usually it's in the back by the dairy. They'll put this cart with all the markdowns from the bread. These are actually baked in store. And um, they mark them down. I'm debating if I wanna become a pig and eat donuts. Don't have to bad for you. But you know, every once in a while, they're actually still pretty fresh. Donuts aren't, I don't think the donuts are baked in store. But I think I'm gonna go ahead and splurge and get donuts today. I'm gonna be a little, or I might get the kind with the stuffing. It's cheaper. This is, but there's only six of these. These are raspberry filled, they call them Bismarck's. Two seventy one. You can save a dollar five. Here you save a dollar thirty eight, but they're not filled. Debating if I want these filled ones. Which ones I want. We'll go with these. Of course I want chocolate. Yeah, you know what? Oh, what to do, what to do? 
I got like a, a sweet tooth. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna get these. I know it's bad, especially since I'm trying to go on a diet. But I gotta give in every once in a while. Maybe a smaller one. It's got two, four, six. This is twelve. So you can get twelve for three fifty-four on sale, or you can get six for two forty-eight, which is like five dollars to buy the same amount. So I think it's better to, to buy the uh, the twelve pack. Anyhow, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some orange juice. That'll be the last bit of food I get, and then um, then I gotta go get the uh, motor oil and the uh, bar chain oil. I don't seem to have the pricing on the um, orange juice. I don't know if that's this. No, it's simply OJ. No, it's four forty-four for orange juice for a um, gallon. Of great value orange juice is four forty four, which I'm gonna go ahead and pay for it. I'll take it. I, I think price wise, these used to be, I think they were like two eighty nine or three twelve or something like that. I don't remember, but it wasn't four forty four. But I'll get it. Um, would like some orange juice. And that I think that is it for our food for today. Although I may pick up some more. Um, I keep saying that, and then I see some other stuff I want. Pick up some of this cheap um, that they have at the uh, Walmart brand cream cheese. These are twice the price that they used to be. They're now $1.94. I think they used to be under a dollar for this uh, cream cheese. Yeah, I'm gonna get some of this to eat and some bread. And um, that is that is definitely it for my food. <laughs> I'll show you guys, uh, I guess I'll do a haul video and show how much all this totaled. I want to thank you all for joining me. I hope uh, you guys are doing well wherever you are and picking up bargains as you see them. Stockpiling on stuff um, that you use regularly because, you know, the price is only going to go up. Until next time, everyone, take care. God bless you all. Stay safe. Bye-bye now.